pink base. I don't think it's gonna be good. Oh my gosh. Oh shoot. It's so painful. Hey guys, so I'm sorry in advance. I am a little sick. But um, I've been delaying this video too long and I think it's about time I film it because I did mention it on my Snapchat that I was going to do the uh, Dollar Tree challenge where I bought all the makeup from Dollar Tree which I only spent $25 on everything. I did, I do have the receipts. There's a few other things here that I bought that I'm not counting because it wasn't makeup but I spent a total of $25. I mean, there wasn't many options, um, so I just did my best in choosing what I think will come out okay. Um, so the goal here is I'm going to do my full face and hopefully I look normal, like, versus when I do my makeup, like with my regular makeup, you know? So let's just get started. I have my hair wet, so I'm just going to pull it back while I do this video so it's not looking cray. Well, it's gonna look great regardless anyway <clears throat> all right so I always start out with my foundation so we're just gonna go ahead and start I got this LA colors liquid makeup in I believe the color is tan yep it's tan and I usually use a beauty blender and I did not find a beauty blender at the Dollar Tree but I did find brushes <laughs> So I know I watched, I think, somebody, I think April, April's video, and I don't think she had brushes. She didn't find any at her Dollar Tree. I did go to two. Um, so anyways, I'm going to use these wedges, and I'm just going to pump this foundation in the back of my hand. I hope it's not too dark, so I just go ahead and pump that. Okay, now let's pray to Jesus. This is going to turn out okay. Okay, I don't even know where to begin. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this the best way I could. I kinda, I'm tempted to use my fingers to be honest. It's actually like a moisturizer. It's like a BB cream, but I, it's not covering much. I'm just gonna go ahead and use my um, fingers. Yeah, because I can tell that I'm not going to be able to blend it with this. So you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and pump it. It's like not covering anything. You see that? Literally like I'm putting lotion or face cream on. Smell too bad. <clears throat> Do I look orange? Black. Anything? I think it's just making me look more tan. Oh, yeah, I think it's just literally giving me a face tan. I got a lighter compact makeup foundation for concealer because there was like no options for, or there was no concealer. So I just figured I would use this. Now I guess I'll try and use this. Maybe I should have used this for my foundation. <clears throat> anyway, it's a cream one, so I'm gonna go ahead. Oh no, I think it's a pink tone, pink base. I don't think it's gonna be good. Oh my gosh. This is not my shade whatsoever. Alright, I'm gonna do my makeup as I normally would. I'm just 
right, so after the concealer is I'm gonna set my under eye. And honestly, I'm just gonna use another sponge. This is Nude by LA Colors Powder. Go ahead and tap. So we're going to be doing the baking. Okay. So now that I set that, I'm going to go ahead and grab this fluffy brush that freaking Hurts. It's like not soft at all. I'm gonna take <coughs> a tan powder by LA Colors. I'm just gonna go ahead and set the rest of my face. You know, and cover all my imperfections with this high coverage makeup. go ahead and pause and just do my shadow so first I'm gonna take the concealer again and just use that as a primer so I'm gonna neutralize my lids fluffy brush from these are wet and wild brand they were a dollar a dollar tree and I'm gonna take the light powder that I used for set baking I'm just gonna go ahead and set my whole eyelid okay okay now let's pause for a second I'm gonna do my brows which did I freaking get all oh, I was like did I get a brow product? And I did. I got this little duo. It's by Color Mates Brow Powder, Dark Medium and Medium Brown. And it comes with a little brush. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use this. So I feel like it's a little red. So I think I'm gonna go with the dark brown. Still looks red on camera, but oh my god. Yeah, that looks pretty red. way better than doing them black. That's the only other option. And I am not going to do my eyebrows black. You know what? This is as good as it's going to get. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeshadow. I got this little 6 eyeshadow by LA Colors. I'm going to go ahead and start with a light my crease. It's even picking up. Oh, and it's shimmery. Yay. Who doesn't like shimmery in the crease? Is all of this shimmery? You know what? Yes, it is. So I'm going to go with my tan powder, face powder. Use that as my... color because it's matte. Just pick up this. Oh. Okay, these eyeshadows are not happening. I'm just going to go ahead and use this because with the brush, it's so hard to pick up the. Oh my god, there's like no color payoff. Okay, 
Okay, now I want to put some darker one. It's not even that dark. On my crease. So I'm just darkening the crease. They all look the same. All these colors look the same. Oh, and then I'm also going to highlight the the brow here. Let's hope this color is not shitty. I mean, oh, don't want to put too much because it is shimmery. I like shimmery shadows in the brow bone. I don't want to look like I have like a bright white under brow. All right. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and use this LA Colors because this is super shimmery and hopefully it just takes the attention away from this hideous shadow. Put a little bit. Okay, that really didn't do anything. That was supposed to be super shimmery in the center. But it didn't do much. Okay. okay. I see you peeking through. Just a little bit. Ugh, so messy. more alive because I do this all the time. Oh my god I can feel the eyeshadow just falling out. I have nature fall out. Right now, I'm, I actually bought these janky as black liners that I figured they were going to be like so hard. Ugh. Like they were going to be pain to put on. I bought these first and then I saw this, this one. So I said, I'm going to buy that one. It's probably easier to apply. Let me see how it works in the waterline. Oh, shoot. It's still painful. is darker when I swatched it. So I'm going to go ahead and try this. I feel like I'm hurting my eyes. Ugh. And I see a hair from this brush. Okay. So now I'm going to go ahead and use the liquid liner. And I didn't find this the first time I was trying to shake it. <laughs> There's like nothing in there. Um, I didn't find this at first Dollar Tree I went to, so I was so happy when I saw it. When I apply um, liquid liner, I don't want no one to talk to me. Is anybody else like that? Like when Juan starts talking to me and I'm doing my liner. I'm not very nice. Okay, now there's one sad part. I did not find um, an eyelash curler. So, I don't think I will have great lashes. This mascara is from LA Colors and it's pretty dry. Tiny one. A 
put some in my lower lash line. This mascara is super dry. That it's like, it doesn't even look like I have any on. Like even if I put another layer, it's not doing anything. So, I think that's going to do. Alrighty then. I forgot to use my bubblegum chapstick to moisturize my lips. Oh. So I'll just go ahead and do that now. Usually you do that at the beginning so your lips are not crusty when it's time for lipstick. It's alright. So I just wanna I, I just wanna like, I don't know, like I can see how light my under eye is. Anyway. Okay. Now it's time for blush, and I think that's it. Blush and lipstick. So look at this. Why would they even do this? Look at the blush brush I got. This looks like an eyeshadow brush. And this is the only color that was available at my Dollar Tree. It's like a mauve pink color. It's called Mauve Alu. From Color Mates, I'm just going to use this crappy brush. And pray for the best again. I'm just going to smile and bring back some color into my cheeks. Oh jeez. <laughs> you guys see that? Oh no. Not cute, Lorenzo. This is not cute. Alright. Alright, Nathan. Hmm. Uh, you know. You gotta look this crazy. I'm just gonna go ahead and line my lips. In preparation for this color that I chose is Black Orchid. Probably not the best color to choose from Dollar Tree, but... That's what I got. Okay. Should I put some on? What the heck? I'll put a little bit on for dimension in the center. Okay, so anyways guys, this is the final look. Um, Dollar Tree makeup challenge right here in your face. I know you can't believe it. I look amazing. I mean, just this color match though is just life, okay? It's life, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did the Dollar Tree makeup challenge, let me know. Link it down below. Send it to me. I can go watch it. I don't know. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Ooh. And I will see you guys next time. Back to mommy life.